lads and lads, it's Fisk and I here bring you Awkward Dimensions Redux, which I have never played. I saw it on Steam and thought it looked cool, so we're going to try it. Yeah, sleep here and wake up here. I'm guessing wake up is just exit the game, honestly. That's what sleep is. These may be Awkward Dimensions. I do is very important. Please use headphones. Dreams. Okay. I don't know what's happening here. It's just a guy stumbling around in the dark looking at an alarm clock. Oh! Legible? Can I, can I run? I the controls. Oh, hold up. You can use a gamepad for this? Hold up. That didn't help at all. It does have this creepy looking door though, and whatever's up here. Oh god, that was trippy looking. So if I stop moving, the door stops moving and it kind of forms, right? That's cool. Can I go in it? Correct. Backstage at the joke. Duh, what are you? What are you? Oh, can I interact? Do you play any sweet melodies? That's great. I love the sweet melodies, you know? From the, uh, the disembodied pair of legs that I just happen to keep around, you know? Okay, I'm definitely going to have to go into settings or something for this later. Locked. Why is the door locked? You know what? Okay, space is jump. You know what? I'm just going to use my keypad, my keyboard. Sorry. Can't talk.
game is marginally creepier than I expected it to be. That door's locked. Okay, maybe if I just follow this wall until I find something. I wish I knew what those two guys were actually painting. Are they like doing a scene? Cause it, oh, look. crap. up to the highest rendering it could do because I thought it would be really pretty and it is. It is actually one of the prettiest games I've ever played. I can make noise. Blah, 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 blah. See, noise. Noise is good. That's how you know you can, you're still able to talk and stuff, you know? Why not crouch and then jump? Oh, crap. I suck at this. Hardcore parkour. Parkour 101, guys. Oh, God. Oh, hey, it dropped me back. Oh, yeah, I love that game. Oh, my God. It's so... It's like slingshotty almost. The physics on it are so... Like you jump forward and it slingshots you. Oh my gosh, this is torture. Do I does it we just want me to walk and jump? Maybe I'm just being dumb. Coin. What? Oh no! I was like, please tell me I'm not stuck like that. That would make it for a sucky gameplay. Again, this game's called Awkward Dimensions Redux, and I've never played this before. 
I thought it looked pretty on Steam. And it is pretty on Steam. Okay, it's a pretty piano, but it's very depressing. God, I hate the physics. It's so slingshotty. It's like you jump forward and move backwards and it just slingshots you both directions. And it's dumb physics. Oh, what am I on? Oh, I'm still on this piece. I thought I just broke the game. God, the physics. Go forward. Oh, God. It's one of those unforgiving type games. Prepare. Oh! Oh my gosh, it's so pretty! Look at it all! Just take it all in, guys. This is so pretty. What is that? There's a tumor off that thing. You see it? Sorry, I just ruined that. But, uh, yeah. Okay, so I have a crate. Oh, space gravity! I love it! Dock here. Does it want me to like place this box there? Let's look at it a little closer. I don't know. Oh god! That was terrifying. Legitimately. Okay, this is called Frame. I don't know how many dimensions there are to this. Oh! Oh! What's this? Oh god! <laughs> oh good god! What just happened? Well, I wonder if this is any relation to uh, what those guys were painting earlier. Self something something. Wait, does that say self portrait? That's exactly what it says self portrait. Okay, I don't know what to do here. I saw something on a podium over here. We'll go to it. Pick it up. Oh, is this like a filter? Am I supposed to be looking for something with this? Kind of like a. I can't remember the name of the other game that did this. It was a good game though. Really good. Hold up. There's not this without this. Okay, so it's showing me new stuff. Like these walls here. They weren't here before. Oh, it's an elevator! Do I still need this? Oh, yeah, this is such a cool game concept. I love it! I don't like how I can't see outside the elevator. It's like looking through the elevator now. Oh god! Can I get squished by it? Squish me! Do it! Just do it! Nope. It literally just phased right through me. Go on, get on! Let me on the elevator! I hate the physics. The physics suck, but the game is so pretty, it almost it actually does make up for it. I'm not even going to put almost in there. It makes up for it ten times. The design and just the prettiness of it makes up for it. I'll get over there, though. Okay, I think I finally figured out how to work these physics. Oh, what did it say? Curfew. Oh god! What, what's with the maracas? We're doing some Indian worship music? I'm assuming he wants me to follow this? Very realistic, very. Round of applause for that. Okay, the music is getting a teeny tiny bit louder. God, where are you? Run toward the light! What is that? I 
supposed to go toward it? Oh god. What was that? Okay, I'm not supposed to go toward it. I'm supposed to avoid that. Where else do I have to do this all over again? Honestly, I just thought it was going to be like a jump scare or something. So I figured I'd go ahead and get it out of the way. Because I know if there's a jump scare, I'm going to scream like a little girl. People will laugh at me. But you know what? I don't care. Run toward it. You know, nothing to worry about. See you in your crowd. Gosh. I think I'm supposed to be going down here. There's an outlet. I can end it faster. I'm kidding. Okay. What's it want me to do? Can I pick up the lamp, maybe? No, oh, that not work. Uh, can I do anything with any of this? No, oh, uh... I'm angry at myself, uh, try and sleep, I can't re I can't read that, just dream because it's, alright, so is that just meant to give me enough time to read this, or is it going to restart me here, hot, I'm, I'm hot, I'm, or not, I don't even know, I, I shouldn't be left alone with my own thoughts, drown them out, please, wow, this, this was a, a bad idea, <laughs> this whole game just seems messed up try and sleep please because when you're dreaming you don't god this is terrible have to be yourself anymore uh this used to be my this used to be why i took up something asking i think but even now that doesn't even even works i, I can't even read that that's terrible handwriting so I think this was just designed to give me enough time to read all that. There's nothing in here. And all you can do is turn that off. And now I'm blew up. Nope, there's apparently a way to avoid this. I just have to find it. Okay, it looks like there used to be something here or something. I don't even know. It's like a ghost shadow here. Or is it? Wait, if I turn... Oh, I have an idea. 
turn that off. Walk back over here. Nope. I thought this would do something. Oh! Grab it! What's it want me to do with it? Oh, what's it call in there? They deserve compassion. They need it. Give it your time. It won't let me up. Look at that picture. So Look, damn it. Crap. 45 seconds. Get in there. Okay, I gotta turn this off. any more of these tiles. I don't even know what to do. 32 seconds. Okay. I don't know what to do as far as this painting. Let's read this again. A self-destructive portrait of the art and the artist. What's it want me to do with that though? Well i second, we're going to die this round. Oh yeah, I don't really know what to do. Paper appears. Why? Okay, I know what to do now. You grab the tile, turn on the lamp, and a paper appears. I think you have to grab the tile first. Because I think the paper comes from the tile. And if it does, I'm going to feel like a real big dummy. If it comes from the tile. Which means you grab the tile, throw it down. They deserve passion. They I hear people talking. Look at it. Alright, that's right. Look at the picture. Look, damn it. Picture? Dudes, look at this up. They deserve compassion. They need it. Look at it. Give it your time. Look at the picture. Look. Cuss word. I just want to look at I don't understand. Okay. Oh! Okay, it's just dropping here. Oh, is that the same as that guy was painting earlier? Making me climb so freaking slow. It's because it wants me to see this. Wait, what's this guy doing? He looks distraught. Is he making a paper airplane? That's exactly what he's doing. He's making a freaking paper airplane. Is he gonna throw it at me? Throw it at me. Oh god. Unplayable. What the heck? Don't put out your anger on the players. Uh, waste of internet. Boring cuss word. Uh, bloody cuss. Another cuss. Wow, there's a lot of cussing on this game. Wow. Lackluster in every. Face it. I don't know when we get to the top of this. Do I have to grab one of these, maybe? Maybe it's for top deals. I don't know. Why am I still watching this guy? He's just, he's just raging. I can't understand the words this thing say. He looks like he belongs in a cave to a cave body. And it doesn't matter what happens all the time, but I want to trust the people who are here. 
out on my black man. Oh, look. That, that used to be above me. Now I'm getting somewhere. Oh, look. There's that K-pop dancing. It's a very long game because I don't even think it has save any way to save it. Okay, here's what I got from that. He hates art, but art keeps coming back to him. Because he was like really mad and he was hitting all his art and stuff, which I'm assuming is this. It's like art or drawings or something. I hate these type of games where you just have to interpret it. I wish they would have made the voices a little clearer. Because that would have made this a whole lot more enjoyable. Honestly. Because I only got like bits and pieces of it, honestly. Yeah. How much more of this ladder do I have to go? Do I have to keep going until I reach the top of the screen? Please tell me no. Or do I just sit here, maybe? What's it want me to do? I wonder if that's the game creator that's doing it. The end? This is the end of the game? No, it can't be the end. cars can't kill me because I wasn't even looking. To be honest, I was not concerned about the car. I just wanted to make it. Oh, Lord. What the? Sabotage. Oh, this is, looks like a horror game now. Please tell me I don't have to avoid anything again. That was terrible. I 
just press somebody to tell me that there. It works for a while, but then it catches up to you. I hear a radio. I'm scared of success. I mean, like, when things go well, I... Let's grab a sheet. Oh, I love, I love the, uh, the abstract artwork. I love to buy some shoes like that. Okay. Oh, do I need to put the shoe in here? Is that where it goes? I'm not understanding this. Oh, hold up. Okay. Oh, God. So, did I do that? Okay, I jammed this machine with the shoe. That's what I'm getting from it, anyway. Yeah, it looks like I jammed it. Oh, Lord, what happened? Oh, I woke up. Am I? No, look, I still see some fuzz. I think, I don't think I'm woke up yet. But I need to stop feeling. Really sorry for myself. This is a really emotional game. I love it. I actually legitimately like this game. What's it? Oh yeah, I think it was like a memory. I regret on the surface. Okay, this looks pretty. I wish it would generate farther out. That would be great if it could just generate a little farther out. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going because this one, this one's kind of open, honestly. Wait, if I look, oh, okay, is that as far as I can go? Yeah. Okay, so I do have boundaries, so it won't be that hard. Can I walk through these? Okay, I can. That makes it even less hard. But, I still don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Maybe I gotta find like the highest point or something. I like that you can actually climb on this game, that's nice. Is that as high as I can go? Yep. It is really pretty and all. I actually kind of love this. This is great, to be honest. I heard something. What is this? Is there no sun? Oh! You're not gonna. Whoa! That's kind of mean! You're being a little harsh! Ooh, spooky. I'm kidding. You're in the red. I'm in the red. Okay. What's it want me to do? So I'm guessing this guy has like job problems too. Take a deep breath. Hold. Hold what? Hold the interact? Okay, I took a deep breath. Okay, I think it just wants me to keep taking deep breaths and holding it, and eventually it's gonna like reveal more of the storyline to me. Okay. Oh, yeah, because every time I do that, it's uh, it's changing what's on the board. I'm just not gonna. No, I am good enough. Hey, that's not for you to decide, you magical board of bleh. I hate you, you stupid board. Every time I do this, I'm half expecting like a monster or something to just like smash the board and hit me. I don't know. How long does it want me to hold it? Uh, I got like a shadow here. I 
I'm, you're just not good enough. Wow, this is a terrible game. Actually, the game itself is great. I love it. But like, what if I interact with this pencil here? Ugh. You need a second choice. You need to settle. You need to give up. You're just not good enough. Why is this so mean? I know it's like a metaphor for something, and it's supposed to be depressing, and it's like a cool story, but good gosh, you stupid bored. USC. University of South Carolina. Representing on this game. Okay, I don't know what the USC on here stands for. It just keeps telling me to hold. Okay, I'm holding the interact. And it's inverted everything, pretty much. So what's it want me to do now? I'm so confused! Is this any correlation to anything? God, it's so hard to control this. When it's uh, flipped like this. I may not have a score, so I for thought... my grades aren't perfect, nor am I in the top percentile of my very okay. class. Okay. However, what you don't see, what you, you don't take into consideration, what you ignore is me. You ignore the time, effort, and dedication I put in my passions, my my love for theater, game development, memes, my dog, my family, my friends, my art. And even though your school has the best program for game design, best faculty lessons and class size in the world that can help me do what I love. Regardless of what you say, I'll still make games. Heck, even if you say no, that will give me even more of a reason to continue to make games just to spite you. I actually, no. I make games because it's in my blood. It's what I know my life purpose is. It's the reason why I get up in the morning. It's both my prison and my sanctuary. It's the way I communicate best. It's my everything, and if that's not what it means to be a Trojan, then I don't know what is. So he can't juggle him and I taught myself everything I know about game dev, and the most important lesson I learned was patience. Patience that relies on work ethic rather than motivation. Patience with myself that I can fix that bug or finish that asset or redo something a hundred times over and still enjoy the monotony. But I'll get out of this funk that has been dragging me down since the second semester of junior year. Patience to listen and the willpower to ignore that constant voice in my head that overthinks everything to obsession. That means the way I who I am. Or I guess who I was because I'm not going to settle and not that I come apart who I am. I'm going to be my ambitious self, my creative self, my kind and genuine self, my best self, not a self loathing excuse. It may take some time, but I have the patience. That was great! Okay, so the gist of the game is this guy's a game designer or something like that, and he wants to, like, he can't juggle school and his passion for what he loves to do. So, I guess he gave up with school and he started having these thoughts about, like, I'm not good enough and stuff. And I guess that's what this game is based around. Maybe this is like, not like all these dimensions and stuff, but what if this is the guy that designed its life? Like he he quit school to design games or something. I don't know. What's he doing? Making more, making more games? Stick your hand in the fire. Do it. Just do it. But this is a very beautiful game. This is. Very horror gameish. Uh, let's sit by the fire, roast some weenies, you know. Uh, are we gonna stargaze? Oh my god, they're, yes, we're stargazing! Look at it, it's so pretty. Why is there rings around the stars? It looks like a giant. It looks like a giant septic eye. honest oh 
Okay, I don't know what we're doing at the table. Can I look around yet? Nope. It is still has control of my mouse. It is a very pretty game though. I like the many different layers of colors. Cause it just it just adds more of an effect to it, I guess. What the What is this? Is this a grappling hook? So it all starts with some jazz music Don the Post. Now it's the heist, assassination, the player knows their objective, and has to grapple hook over the wall. Oh, this is this is the game he designed! Oh! Cause he's talking! Grab the rope and hold. Strike of the guard dogs and assassinate his target except for one catch. I love this. This is like a game that he designed. What the? What just happened? Do I have like a gun or something? Nope. Okay, we're gonna try and like run along the length of the wall. Cause I think that there's a connection here. Nope. Okay, we're gonna try and jump down from over here. And then make it up. His target is his because if he doesn't do this, he's fire. He does do it, he's just like that. So that's where it comes right to. My eye, my beautiful eye! Oh, my eye, my beautiful eye, oh no. Is that the game creator? I just think fakes or. Because this looks like a guy else. in that clip. Changed your life. Find the way out. Okay. Point. I didn't even know that, that would actually work. I'm assuming I can like stick to this and wall run it. Oh, this is like a car, a parkour concept. This looks like uh, what's that game? Red Trigger. If you ever play that, it's on Steam. It's free as well. Uh, this reminds me very reminiscent of Red Trigger, honestly. Or, uh... God, I can't think of the other game. But there are there are other games that use this, like, bright colors concept. Red Trigger just happens to be one of them. See, I love the door concept. The door concept was... Get, well, the door concept is what gets me most. I also like how it has these like realistic scenes in it. Was that? Oh my god, that was such a good game. I loved it. It was a good concept. Good art style, mostly. I love the art style of it. You could have used some touch up here and there, but I mean, I'm not a game designer or anything, so I can't really put that out there. But uh, I liked how he actually incorporated himself into it. I'm pretty sure that at the end with the guy, I think the guy in the jacket to the left, I think that was the game creator because he looked like the guy in the, uh, the one that was throwing the pictures and got really mad at the thing on the easel. But uh, yeah, that was actually a really good game, I would have to say. Is it going to bring me back to a home screen or what? I think that's it. Okay, guys. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is a really good game. It's only 45 minutes long if you play it through like I did. I mean, because my record time is 45.33 right now. So it's not a very long game. I think it's meant to be played in one sitting. 
actually, uh, there's a level selector right here. So I think. Oh, hey! You can actually select your levels. Never mind. Because here's the first one I went to, the one where the guys were painting. This is the one with the beach that I thought was so pretty with the pictures. That's really cool. Okay. Anyway, that's me all for this video. Make sure you drop, kick that like button, subscribe, tell a friend. I'm out, beautiful people.